for Manchester United. Scored for France last weekend. Hits for Ronaldo. And uh, an easy block for Asu Ikoto. From Spurs summer signings from Lens. Ronaldo. Left foot. And it curled into Robinson. And about a foot by Ronaldo. And he has the crowd on its feet. Richardson angles it through to Giggs. Furthest United player forward, and Saha was caught by Davids. Eight minutes gone. Ronaldo will take this Manchester United free kick. And Spurs happy not to have a war. Carried away, and Ryan Giggs puts Manchester United ahead after eight minutes. He celebrates his first ever Player of the Month award with his second goal of the season. Curious that Tottenham didn't need a wall, they felt. Robinson could only parry the bending shot, and Giggs on hand with a header. It wobbled in the air, and Giggs re reacted first to the goalkeeper's push out. Ronaldo dug in the shot, it wobbled in the air, and after the parry, Giggs reacted the fastest. Chinis, Garland, Keane, better from Tottenham, back to Genus, who scored here last season, and that's Tottenham's best move of the game by far. Here's Rio Ferdinand, and Carrick, to Ronaldo, Carrick again, Saha, Ball won by Garley, but straight to Richardson. That's why. Uh, better movement from the Manchester United midfield players in support of their front runners. Garley, Dawson has stayed forward, wins it effortlessly in the air against Evra. And Carrick tidies up against his old club, but he, it's still not away. This is Davitz. Brown back to him. United suddenly defending very deep, and Dawson's in here for Spurs. Harry by Van der Sar, King in there as well. Both Spurs centre backs in action in the Manchester United penalty area, and Van der Sar keeps it 1 0. Poor clearances by United. Genus. Chimbonda. Ronaldo trying to get back at him and did so, and it's deflected cruelly. And Van der Sar had to spring and tip it over. Suddenly, Ronaldo realised he had to get back at him, and Van der Sar keeps Spurs at bay. Ledley King towards the near post, beyond him, headed down by Dawson. A real chance for Spurs. And they won't get many. Saha. Manchester United playing around Spurs. The cross look for Richardson. It'll drop to Ronaldo. It's a corner. Robinson was there for Spurs. And that's a really good save by the England goalkeeper. Giggs with the corner. Brown with the touch on. And Chimbonda can bring it away for Spurs. Defoe's on the halfway line. And he's come away with the ball. And it was a rudimentary challenge by Richardson. Defoe, good strength, good run. And Van der Sar will pick it up as Carrick chased back and got in the all-important challenge on Defoe. Koto. Right foot in. Oh, and there was Jermaine Defoe. And where he could finish here last week for country, he couldn't finish for club.
Masangali. Picks up Nida. And Van der Sar, I have to say. Another chance has come Spurs way. But Mido, just like Defoe and Dawson earlier, hasn't been able to take the opportunity. Giggs. Back to O'Shea. Fletcher. Park. Fletcher, beautiful. Saha, can United finish here? Oh, it was wayward with Ronaldo at the far post. In space and waiting. And it would have been the crowning glory of a move built up with patience and precision. Fletcher. Park. Giggs. Saha onside. Can he finish it here? I see a cover is back at him. Saha. He can't finish it. Saved by Robinson. And Manchester United could have made sure there and should have with Louis Saha. He's missed two good opportunities now. In his own half as the ball was played. Kept his feet, but not his composure. Robinson stood up to it. Could this be Spurs' last hope of an equaliser? Only seconds remain. Genius with the corner. Neville flicks it out. Ziegler back in, looking for Meadows' header. And it's over, and surely Spurs' chance is gone. They've missed second-half opportunities, as Manchester United have failed to make the game safe. United have missed chances at the other end too. But surely the 1-0 victory now will give them their best-ever Premiership start. We usually slow starters, and we did say that we wanted to get off to a good start this season, but we have to keep it going. We've got difficult games ahead, uh, Celtic Wednesday night and then Arsenal Sunday, so they're not getting any easier, the games, and uh, my biggest test yet to come. First half, I don't think they, they cause us a lot of problems, but yeah, if you come to Old Trafford, you get maybe two, three possibilities at the most, and we had probably five, so yeah, I think we should have, we should have had a result over here. It was, it was a very entertaining...